is Nikki and I'm here to share the messages that I get from Spirit with you to help you on your journey to unconditional love as they are helping me and also to share some of the things that everyone is sending me who have joined into the crystal grid and also have had healing from me so um <clears throat> and just to say it really is incredible what the power of love does um, and the power of the, the grid that is connecting us all and all of our higher selves that are helping each other on this journey. So this is just following on again from yesterday's message. And um, a lady sent me this. She had actually placed a gold star on her grid. Um, and she has a gold ribbon as well. And she just sent me a note to say, oh my goodness, I can't believe um, I was just watching your video. And then I saw that you have the gold ribbon on your healing, um, on your shamanic um, healing tool from the video yesterday. So again, this just shows you how connected the higher selves are because we are all doing the same things. Um, we are all being guided to use the same energies, have the same, we, we are gui guided to um, have the same songs, not only the same songs, but animal symbology, everything. So that just shows you how connected all of the energies are in the universe, basically, helping us bring together the twin flames. Because don't forget that it is a divine mission that Twin Flames do come together, right? Because we are here to raise the planet in love and light, to change the world. Um, which I know sounds like, wow, we're here, like superhero stuff. But I mean, seriously, that is what we're here to do. So, of course, we're, we're going to have a huge amount of support to make that happen. Um, so just have to, just have to remember that, you know, when you're feeling like kind of like down or thinking you're not with them or just remember there is a bigger reason as to why Twin Flames will be coming together and that is to send out unconditional love around the world. <clears throat> now, just when I was getting ready to do this message, um, on the radio came a band called Twin Atlantic, and it comes on quite a lot, funnily enough. Um, also, um, the intro to it, they were talking about making wishes come true. And the next song that came on was an Ed Sheeran song, which is called Shape of You. Um, and this is the message, this is, well, these are the lyrics for today. So, girl, you know I want your love. Your love was handmade for somebody like me. I'm in love with the shape of you. We push and pull like a magnet do. <laughs> so, you know, this is just incredible because this song has just come out. Now, going back quite a long time, probably a month ago, the guidance that we were getting through was very much about the pull, the push and the pull of the magnet and the draw of the heartbeats the, the universal heartbeat like being like a magnet and drawing the divine masculine in so it's just you know again perfect timing that this song has now just been released and the lyrics are we push and pull like a magnet do so you know tapped into those energies again you see the songwriters are tapped into the same energies and are writing songs literally around the same um, guidance and energies that we're following. So again, incredible. Um, the other part of this message is about my flatmate, I've said before, I think is a, he is waking up um, very slowly, but anyway, he is. Anyway, so the film that he, we, we were watching Netflix last night and he said, I'm gonna choose the film. He chose the film, which is called Pan, Pan, Pan's Labyrinth. Um, I'd never seen it before, but it is a mystical film which is based on energy portals and going through a portal into a magical world where the girl saves her parents. Now, at the very end of the film, there is a flower that grows on a tree. The reason why this is so amazing is that just two days ago, there was a lady who is again on the crystal grid who sent me a picture of a flower. 
um, because I had recently done healing for her and her Divine Masculine and um, the, the, she, so she sent me the picture of this flower. So I'm watching the Pam's Labyrinth and all the way through there's signs and messages etc. But at the very end on the tree grows a flower and when I look at the flower I was like oh my goodness that is the flower that I've been sent by somebody on the crystal grid. So again, just incredible because all of these signs are signs again from the universe to not lose hope, to stay in the love vibration because the love vibration and the golden stardust energy and the diamond energy and all of the energies that we're moving into as we rise up and up and up in our vibration it's these energies that are going to balance and align us and pull in, literally like a magnet, the Divine Masculine or your Divine Partner. It doesn't matter about the sex. So I then Google Pam's Labyrinth because I was like, what is this flower? Because I was like, there must be significant about the flower. In the Wikipedia for the film, um, Pam's Labyrinth, it says, right, listen to this, brilliant. The flower at the end of the film has been cited as evidence that the magical world certainly exists, but only for those who choose to see it. This means the kingdom is both real and not real, a paradox. Right? So how perfect is that? Because actually moving into this new life love vibration is a choice, right? You either see it or you don't. You either go into the heart and live in your heart or you choose the ego, right? So, and when you live in your heart, that's when the magic happens. That's when these incredible connections happen around the world. That's what we're seeing now with everyone that's joining the crystal grid. So it's just amazing. Now, what I've been guided to do is um, I think I know for a fact that my twin is going through a very difficult time and he is, both of his parents are in hospital. Um, I am doing Reiki for him and his parents every single day. And I know that this must be a sign of what's happening for other Divine Masculines as well, is that their lives are being shaken up a bit. Um, <clears throat> and so <clears throat> what I want to offer is a special offer throughout January for Reiki Holy Fire Healing for, for you basically to balance the energies between you and your Divine Masculine and send Holy Fire Reiki and the Goddess energies out to your Divine Masculine and to you. Because I feel that I know for a fact that if my twin is going through a really difficult time, then I'm pretty sure that that is indicative that lots of them are. So, <clears throat> and I am being guided to do this. So I'm going to offer a special for the month of January that the um, Holy Fire Reiki healing, which I do a distance healing, I connect to your energies, I see everything like a movie, so I see and then, and then I write it down for you. So you receive a overview of what I saw in the healing and the messages that your souls want you to know. Um, and it will help you on your journey back to each other. I also get a guided mantra for you. I get guidance on what, and if you say the mantra, then it will align your energies. And I also do a three card angel reading for you. So um, if you would like that, I'm gonna make it as a special offer, 20 pounds, for the month of January and it is purely because I'm being guided because I know that my twin is going through a hard time I know that he needs this and so for other people that are sharing on this journey with me then their their twins could be going through the same obviously not exactly the same but I know that their energies and their lives are being upturned so if you would like to receive the Holy Fire Reiki for yourself and your divine partner, then please do contact me. I will put the link into the description box. It is £20 and you will receive an update from me um, with the mantra, with everything that I see and the messages that I get for you. Um, and also I just wanted to say thank you to everyone that is joining the crystal grid I have just sent out a load of crystals for people that just joined before Christmas because I didn't want them to get lost in the Christmas post 
So thank you. Anyone else joining, then please do. Take care. Bye.